Hello there everybody, it is me, Freezer Bunny, and welcome back to my channel. So today guys, I'm going to be doing an overview and showcase of all the clothes and hairstyles that you guys can unlock when you use the um, unlock outfits cheat. There you go. So this is really, really easy. It's just a cheat, but it gives you lots and lots of outfits and hairstyles, more than a 100 plus outfits and hairstyles together and you don't even need to use um i mean you don't even need to download anything and you know this is completely free of custom content so yeah it's going to be awesome and there's going to be lots of new stuff to see so yeah um first things first i'd like to say that i have all expansion packs so this is going to be a complete overview of all the unlockable outfits you get um, from all the expansion packs and the base game as well and you guys can see that we are in the beautiful sunlit tides and this is just a random selection and we have our random couple which just so happens to be Mary Sue and um, Daniel Pleasant which are one of the main sims that we have in the sims 2 so I think they would be an ideal couple to showcase to you guys um all the stuff that we're gonna see so anyway um this is what we're gonna do first of all we need to enter the cheat called um testing cheats enabled on so we're just gonna um control shift d there we go to bring out the cheat box and enter testing cheat enabled on and okay so it's accepted i guess and then we need to enter the well, we need to bring out the cheat box once again, and we need to enter the unlock outfits on cheat. Unlock outfit on. There you go. It's really, really easy. And um, if you guys didn't see, I will put um, like I'll put the cheats on the screen so you guys can see, like right now. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully that is enough time. So. Pretty much after that, what you do is you just, you can now enter create a sim. So what you do, um, you don't need to get out of, um, you don't need to edit town or you don't need a closet pretty much. All you need to do is shift click on a sim. So I'm pressing shift now and click on Daniel Pleasant and click edit sim and create a sim. And that is going to bring us to create a sim where hopefully all the stuff that we just unlocked is already unlocked so yeah so i guess i'm just gonna start with the young adult life state um but i will show you guys everything so i'm pretty sure this is going to be a considerably long video so that's just a little bit of this a disclaimer for you guys so let us start with the hairstyles and um, okay you guys can already see that we have the first one over here which came with into the future and this is Emmett Rolivart's hairstyle so that is it and oh, let's see here I'm not even gonna bother changing his hair color because you guys can discover it for yourselves if you guys want to and let's see here um let's see here i'm just gonna take this really really slow so that i don't miss any hairstyle so hopefully i don't miss any okay this one i'm only seeing it now and it came with ambition so this looks like it is another hairstyle that can be unlocked um this and this one is also another one that i haven't seen before and it also came with ambition ambitions so, um, yeah, it looks like it's another hair so that you guys can unlock. And, um, yeah, Ambition came with the, um, the Stylist Carrier, so you guys can unlock this when you're in the Stylist Carrier, pretty much. And, let's see here, um, this one I'm also seeing for the first time, so, this, these hair stuff that came with Ambition, you guys can probably access through the Stylist, um, um, what's it called? The object thing, the the mirror stylist, um, podium or whatever. So yeah, that's it. You guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and let's see here. Um, I'm not so sure whether these can be unlocked, but I'm kind of seeing them now for the first time. I'm really not so sure, but it's like a semi bald hairstyle with like some cutouts or whatever shaved parts in them. So I don't know. I think that probably came with later. I'm not so sure. Um, this one I have not seen, 
Um, so it probably came with a stylist because it looks like it came with ambitions as well. And this one, which I'm familiar with because this is available for the kids actually as a hairstyle. So it also came with ambitions. And this one also came with ambitions. So, and it's the first time I'm seeing this as well. It's really, really retro looking. So yeah, I can't exactly tell 100% which came. Um already unlocked and which ones you have to unlock when using specific items and all that stuff so um if there's like a discrepancy i hope you guys are a little bit forgiving because i'm not really sure but anyway moving on with the showcase um there's a lot of hairstyles that i'm seeing for the first time this one i'm seeing for the first time i'm not so sure though these probably came with a base game i'm just not sure because i don't scroll down this this far i don't scroll this far down when I'm creating my sims and this one I'm pretty sure came with ambitions and this one is kind of a failure type of hairstyle for a stylist you guys can see that there's bald patch over there so if the stylist fails that's what you get pretty much so yeah that is going to be it for the hair without accessories and let us see the hair with accessories um, okay, there we go. And of course, you have this one, which is actually hairstyle. I didn't realize that. Um, it came with Into the Future, and this you guys can unlock when you have the robot fan trait. So that is it. And yeah, it's it's a hairstyle. I didn't realize it was hairstyle. And these ones, um, which are like diving gear or whatever, diving. Kind of ironic that he has sunglasses on, but whatever. Which came with um island paradise so these ones you guys can unlock i guess when you maximize the diving skill i'm not so sure this one i'm not so sure if you guys have to unlock but i might as well show you guys and they also came with island paradise um of course these um toga hats uh, that's what i'm gonna call them or graduation hats i guess um you guys can unlock obviously when you graduate from university and they came with sims university of course and these mascot um heads oh the llama actually looks a little bit creepy so these llama mascots you guys can unlock um when you guys learn the mascot hidden skill i believe so yeah these came with university and this is another mascot head this one is um kind of the gnome i believe i'm not so sure this is the gnome or I don't know Santa. I'm pretty sure it's a gnome. So you guys can also unlock that from The Sims 3 University Life. And let's see here. These ones um <laughs> are frog heads, and um they came with Supernatural. And you guys can unlock these. Ooh, there's a ball patch over there. You guys can unlock these when you cast like the frog turning spell into a sim and. It kind of turns them into a frog mutant sim, whatever, ninja turtle, I don't know. So yeah, <laughs> when you're a witch, you can cast a spell or you can probably make an elixir, I forgot. But these came with Supernatural. And let's see here, there's a lot of stuff. Like these ones, I'm not so sure if you guys unlock them or whatever. But I haven't seen them before, so that's that. And these hats as well. But they came with ambition, so these are probably already unlocked um these ones are really interesting um these are like fantasy type hats and i'm actually really really happy that we have these and i'm disappointed that i haven't seen these before because they're freaking amazing look at them they're freaking stunning they are like medieval medieval fantasy type hats and this actually came with a set of outfits and also shoes and stuff so that's really cool and they came with ambitions and I'm pretty sure these ones you need to unlock using the unlock um using the unlock outfits cheat because I've never seen them before. And I'm just speculating how to unlock them. It's probably um with a time machine. You guys if you guys have the inventing skill, you guys can create a time machine. So you guys can go back in time or you guys can go to the future. Um, in a kind of rabbit hole type of thing. So this, when your sims come back, they, they're probably going to be wearing stuff like this. And um, these ones I also haven't seen before. And, and I'm not so sure what this is. It's probably a fire. Yeah, it's probably for the fire um, firemen. And so yeah, you guys have to unlock this when you're in the firefighter career. 
with ambition. And there's also tons of stuff. Um, here we go. I'm not too sure if you have to unlock this, but these came with Showtime and they are for the genie. So yeah, that's that. And um, let's see here. Hmm. These hats, there's a ton of them and there's different um, patterns on top of them you guys can see. So these probably are used for different NPCs. This one is probably for the mailman. This one is for, I don't know, the fire, uh, the police station. I'm just guessing. I'm not so sure. This one is probably, I don't know, looks like athletic or the police station because this could be a police badge. This one is probably for the delivery boy. And this one, yeah, I think this one is for the police, for the law enforcement. And this one is another, I don't know what the difference, but yeah, it, it could get a little bit glitchy at times when the, the assets, hairstyles, and the clothes sometimes double up. But it doesn't, you know, it doesn't harm your computer that much anyway. So yeah, these are it. I'm not so sure which one is which, but those are the available ones for the NPCs that you can now put on your stems. So yeah. And moving on, um, these ones um, probably came with the military career, which is a base game career, so that is it. You guys probably unlock this when you reach level 10, but I'm not so sure what level, so don't quote me on that. These ones, I'm really not sure. I'm going to guess that they're for the plump Simbots, or Plumbot. I think for the Simbot, they came with Ambitions. So if you guys have the inventing skill and if you guys could maximize that to level 10, you guys can create kind of like a plum bot similar to Into the Future. But these are like much, much less advanced than bots. So that is it. And there's also like a ton of hats as well for the various NPCs that we have. This one looks like it's for the police. This one is probably for the military now that I think of it. And this one is the exact copy of this one, that one that I showed you guys earlier. And this one is for the military as well. This one is for the firefighter. And um, this one looks like it's also for the military as well. And this one looks like it's a chef's hat, definitely, for the culinary career. And I'm not so sure if you have to unlock this one, but it looks like it's probably for the journalism career. And uh, let's see here, what else do we have? Here are some more stuff for the culinary career, and um, another hat, and for the firefighting career. And all of these actually look like they came with a base game. I'm not so sure about this firefighter's hat, because I'm not so sure of that. But it doesn't have the ambition logo, so it's probably unlockable if you have base game only. And finally, for the hair with accessories for men, we have this mummy kind of torn down face that's actually kind of freaking creepy if you guys ask me it's kind of creepy but it, you guys can see that it goes in his face so that is not what it looks like if it's on an actual mummy i guess so yeah that is pretty much it for all the hair cells let me just switch to a more decent looking one so that we can um see just choose a hairstyle here real quickly. Okay, that works. And let's see if there are some new unlockable um, um, facial hair. Uh, nope, it doesn't look like there's any. Um, and let's see, I'm pretty sure there's no unlockable body hair. And um, for the looks, um, let's see, I'm not so sure, but there, there's probably like some new makeup and stuff. So let us check that out. Um, Let's see here, um, alright, this one I haven't seen before, and you guys cannot see it, I'm so sorry, but he is wearing sunglasses, so, um, these are probably like a failure when you have the ambitions, because it's, it's kind of a weird color, so I'm guessing that's a failure when you're in the stylist career, and these ones are really, really funny, um, these are like smudged eyeliners, um, I guess we're gonna see better because I'm pretty sure they also have these for the women, but these are that. You guys can see he's like tearing up and stuff. And they also came with ambition. So if you're stylist if you're in the stylist career and you pretty much fail at styling your stem, that's what you're gonna get that's what you get. <laughs> and these ones look like they're super th thick foundation, even though it doesn't look so bad on him. And this one as well, I'm also seeing for the first time. So these are probably like foundations that you get from ambitions as well. 
and uh, we also have some messed up lipstick that obviously came with ambitions for the stylist career as well so if your stylist fails this is what your sim is gonna look like which is super hilarious and oh my gosh let me just take that off because that's gonna freak me out and um for the um this okay and for the costume makeup there's i guess several i'm not so sure which ones you have to unlock and which ones don't um but these ones um came with decent i guess and i'm pretty sure you guys can access these um if you have on the festival a lot for face painting so i'm pretty sure you guys can you, you guys cannot access access these um from the get-go and create a sim so these are those it looks like there are different themed seasons as well. There's one for fall, this one's for winter, and all that good stuff. And this one's for summer. And here we have for. It looks like for Supernatural. And I actually can see just a little bit of like veins over here on his head. And it's probably for the vampire. Yep, it's probably for the vampire. It's really, really creepy. You guys have to probably put this in HD so you guys can see a little bit more clear. And for Showtime, we have these face paints that you get. If you're a mime or something, ooh, it's really creepy. And this is probably for the Acrobacker, which you guys will unlock. And this one is obviously for the bur Burglar. So, yeah, and it came with a base game. So I apologize for the sunglasses. I have not thought of removing that. This one came with seasons, and it's probably from the pie eating contest. So you got your sim's face is literally like smothered in pie. <laughs> and I'm not so sure what this one is. Um, I guess it's like a failed um attempt at a face painting. So yeah, there's also, so yeah, if your sim are in a festival lot and they have their face painted there's a there's a chance that it will fail and this is these are probably what you're gonna get and they are hilarious really really funny so it looks like that is going to be it for the facial makeup and stuff and let us see really quickly um new tattoos if we have any Ooh. now i really do not put any tattoos on my sim so i cannot tell um which ones are um already unlocked when you start off your game from the get-go and which ones um you have to unlock using the cheat or using um whatever kind of requirement they have like achieving opportunities or reaching a specific level in your job but these ones i'm seeing for the first time so i'm guessing we have to unlock them and they came with ambition so yeah um ambitions you guys can also be a tattoo artist so if you guys fail these are probably oh my gosh this is freaking hilarious it's, it's really really cute though it's like a stick person it's really really cute so that is it. oh my gosh I'm not even gonna go there but this looks freaking hilarious and I don't know okay so that is it for the tattoos I'm just gonna remove it okay guys are you guys ready now we are going to move into the clothing for men and um, I'm just gonna wait for it to load here really quickly so yeah like I've said earlier um these assets you guys can unlock them in a lot of different um opportunities or if you guys reach a specific um level in your career if you guys befriend a specific person you guys can unlock all of these and um i'm pretty sure you guys can never complete the sims 3 game experience like 100 percent um so i'm pretty sure this sheet is going to be really really helpful for you guys you know if you guys like to do machinimas or let's plays of a specific theme and you guys are a little bit apprehensive of putting custom content in your game and if you guys are like me who are freaking cheapo creepo broke people and um who cannot spend any money on star content no not not no money but very very little money on star content because i have to survive and stuff and have to go through school and all that stuff so this sheet is really really helpful um because it's free and all, all of this stuff is already in the game so Hopefully I don't miss anything. Alright. Um. <laughs> so, let's see here. Mm. 
okay there's a ton of stuff for men and i'm pretty sure there's like twice as much stuff for women so god help us on that <laughs> this one came with um generation and i honestly i'm not so sure what these are for i'm guessing they're from the um the what do you call that um these can be unlocked from the imaginary friends if you guys like make them into actual people but i'm not so sure don't quote me on that because i'm really not sure but i'm seeing this for the first time so this one probably came well it came with um base game and these are probably this is probably like from the uh i'm not sure maybe journalism career or i could see this in the um Political career, I guess, if you guys reach level 10, if if you become leader of the free world. This one came with the base game, and I think it can be unlocked from the athletics career. So that is that. And this one, ooh, it is a wild outfit. It looks really wild, I guess. And I guess this can also be unlocked from the um, political career. Um, and I remember, if you guys remember, the royal family... Um, Sims music video, the parody of the royal wedding. Um, I was really looking for what Prince William was wearing for his wedding day, and it looks like this was it because it just looked like an ordinary suit, which had this medallion over it. So I'm really happy that I found that. And these are some more stuff which I honestly do not know how you unlock because I ha I just realized right now that I haven't explored generations that much. These are probably like seriously. Maybe for the babysitting, I'm not so sure. Or probably really for the imaginary friends, I'm not sure. So you guys will have to discover for yourselves. And these ones are just the repeat versions of the ones that we saw earlier. And this one is from the base game. And it's probably um for like the cleaning people. I don't know. I don't know. For your maid, nail maid, I guess what they wear is really really sexy though i love how like three buttons are unbuttoned and all that stuff and this one as well came with generations i'm really really not sure how you unlock these probably from the babysitting and all that stuff and this one i'm i'm seeing this for the first time and so i'm not so sure whether you have to unlock this or not but it looks like it's tattered clothing and it looks really really similar to the tattered clothing that we get with supernatural and the limited edition of island paradise so yeah um so there's more tattered clothes for your sims to wear and this one is also for the athletics carrier i believe so you guys can unlock that together with this one if you reach a certain level and so yeah like i've said earlier the clothes like literally repeat themselves which is kind of weird but whatever it works and let me just put something really really interesting on him that is not okay let's just put this on him because it's the simplest thing i can find and let us see if there are any new bottoms for the men. So I'm just going to give it a minute to load. Real quickly. <laughs> okay, there are new bottoms. This one is the mermaid tail, or should I say merman tail. Okay, it glitches out a bit over there. But I guess it will look fine when your sims are in the water, I guess. Or, I don't know. So, <laughs> if you guys... um. So yeah, you guys can only see your mermaid or merman tails um, when your sims are in the water. So if you guys want to do machinimas when they're on land and you don't want to put custom content, you guys can always use this. So yeah, that's what it looks like. And yeah, it came with Island Paradise. And let's see here. Um, hopefully I don't miss something. I apologize if I do and if you guys are like screaming at me if I missed something. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Anyway, um, these ones, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm honestly really not so sure. And I'm actually kind of perplexed. Like, where would you use these pants? Like, probably from the imaginary friend or if you have the, um, I don't know, the babysitting career? I don't know. I guess you guys, this could be paired with, like, the crazy ombre colorful top that we saw earlier. So, yeah that and these are some tattered jeans to match that tattered shirt that we saw earlier if you want to make like hobos or just sims who like to show some skin in like this kind of way you guys can have matching tops and bottoms and this one which i'm pretty sure matches one of the suits that we saw earlier that also came with generations i really don't know how to unlock this 
and I'm repeating that for like the hundredth time, just to make it clear. Whoa. And these ones as well came with generations. No clue how to unlock them, but they're really, really cute. This one I could see a cowboy kind of wearing it. So let me just put like some random stuff on him. Okay, and we are going to move on to the outfits for the men. And I am going to give it a minute to load really quickly. And see what we have here. Okay, so... Like I've said, I have all expansion packs and I have all stuff packs except for Diesel and um, Town Life. I no no no, except for Diesel and movie stuff. So thank you so much to EA for gifting the Town Life stuff for the Sims anniversary earlier this year, and I downloaded it for free from Origin. So that was a really really awesome thing for them to do. So anyway, moving forward with the um, full body outfits for the men, we get this one. Which came with Into the Future, you guys can see the different stencils that it has. So if you if you guys have your sim that has like a bot fan trait, you guys can already unlock this one. And this one, I honestly do not know how you unlock it, but it looks freaking badass. Are you kidding me? Look at that. It looks freaking cool. I love how shiny it is. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Probably when you maximize your bot building skill to level 10, or if you win in the bot arena, I really don't know, I really don't know. But it's really, really cool, and I love it. It's one of my favorite looks from Into the Future. And this one, which is the one that Emmett Lillivart is wearing, who is the time traveler. I guess if you add him to your household, you guys can unlock it. And it's really cool because, um, look at it, it glows. Like, the lining of the suit and the pants and the shirt. And the back as well it is like neon iridescent and really really awesome. Um, okay, so there is one full body outfit that came with in Island Paradise, and it's it is it is this diving sort of thing that kind of matches with another hairstyle that we saw earlier. So I'm not so sure how you unlock this. Probably when you um, maximize your diving skills to level 10, or if you achieve like a specific opportunity or whatever. These ones are graduation robes, which came with university. So if you guys finish university all your terms, you guys can have this for your graduation. And some mascots as well that came with university. So if you befriend the mascot and ask him to train you um, to become a mascot, you guys can unlock this. Um, so this is the gnome one that also has a matching head and matching shoes. And this is the llama one, which has a matching head and shoes as well. This one, I'm not so sure. Um, I have not experienced all university majors yet, but um, this one looks like it's probably going to come from the technology major. I'm not so sure. And it looks really interesting. I'm not so sure. I'm really not sure, but it looks really interesting. I'm not going to put this on my sims for every day, but you know, if I'm filming something that needs CG effects, I could probably use this. <laughs> Or not, I really don't know. And this one came with seasons, and you guys can unlock this when you add an alien to your household. Really, really cool. There's also like matching shoes that come with it, and also a female version as well. So yeah, and moving on to Showtime, which gives us a lot of unlockable clothes with the three um, new professions that came with Showtime. So those are Singer, um, acrobat and magician. So I've, I'm probably gonna mix them up because I cannot tell which one is which because I've only played a singer and an acrobat. Haven't played a magician yet in all the years of Showtime. So um, I'm, I apologize in advance if I get mixed up with all these outfits and all that stuff. So this one looks like it's probably for I'm gonna say magician because I've never seen this before, and I'm. Um, Honestly, really not sure though. And this one as well. Um, really, really cool looking. I like this. It looks really, really, really prim and proper. And this one kind of looks a little bit, I don't know, assassin to me. And I'm not too sure how you unlock this, but yeah. Probably for the magician. This one I'm pretty sure came with a singer. Really, really cool and really contemporary and really, really flashy as well to make them stand out on the stage. This one also came with a singer, and um, I'm pretty sure about that. Really, really nice textures, if you guys can see. I love the textures on the pants, and I love the shape of it. So yeah. And this one also, 
I guess came with a singer if you guys are doing singograms and all that stuff your sims will wear this on their early stage of being a singer <laughs> this one I have no clue um, probably for the magician it looks like it would come with a magician, but I'm not so sure these ones were, I'm not, maybe acrobat, I really don't know. Oh, uh, these are probably the acrobat male version, I'm not sure. So don't quote me on that, but these are unlockable as well. I really like it in this color. And this one, um, I'm not so sure, probably magician, if I remember, if I recall seeing these in Let's Plays, probably. I love the textures that came for the pants. I wish they were more consistent with the textures because, um, you know, Showtime was kind of in the middle of all the expansion packs when it comes to the release. But in my opinion, these outfits that we're seeing now have some of the best looking pants there is. So that kind of sucks that you just, that they have to come together as an outfit. Because if these came separate, I would seriously put them on my Sims like every day. <laughs> every time I play. And this one really looks like it's for the magician, so I'm not even gonna guess. I'm pretty sure this is for the magician. And this one is probably for the um I don't I don't know magician I guess or a clown it looks like I'm not so sure. Probably yeah for the magician. And this one is probably for the acrobat if you maximize the ooh this looks like a frog for some strange reason. I love the tights. <laughs> really really funny and <laughs> so yeah if you guys probably maximize the acrobat profession that's what you get this one is freaking hot <laughs> you guys can see so much skin and it kind of has like some chains on it and some leather belts and stuff you're really really hot obviously like um fan for the fans i guess and here we have some more stuff for the acrobat. Um, there's also a female version of this, if I recall. And fan service as well, you guys can see pretty much um, through what he's wearing. So yeah, fan service. And this one is like the most fan service out of all of them. And this one also came for the acrobat. Um, because if you guys are an acrobat, you start off as a mime for some strange reason. And this is what you get from that. So yeah, it looks like that is going to be it for Showtime. Here we have Genies, but these I'm pretty sure don't necessarily have to be unlocked. Because I see this, these when, um, I'm pretty sure these are automatically unlocked when you have Supernatural. And so yeah. So let's see here. These ones, I have no clue how you unlock. These are probably for the Architect or the Private Investigator that came with, um, ambitions i guess so that is it probably for architect or private investigator i'm not so sure this one i'm pretty sure it's for the firefighter a really really cool this one i'm pretty sure it's for the firefighter as well now let me get just tell you guys i have not played all the professions and all the careers so i'm really really not sure what i so don't quote me 100 percent and i'm saying i'm just you know guessing it's an educated guess though so yeah I'm pretty sure I'm going to be right more often than not. This one is for the Ghost Hunter, I'm pretty sure, because I've played that. And this one is also for the Ghost Hunter as well, and there's also some female versions of those. And I'm not so sure whether these ones you have to unlock, but I might as well show you guys these stuff. Um, probably for the tattoo artist or the stylist. Or probably the architect. Um... If you guys don't know a little bit about me, I'm actually working on my degree for um, Bachelor's in Science for Architecture. So these ones I could totally relate to. If you're drafting on a drafting table, you are going to get dirty like there's no tomorrow. Like, seriously. And these ones also make your sim look dirty. Really, really cool and really, really... um. You know, there's lots of personality in all of these stuff, you know, it's really specific to your sims personality, I guess. So if your sims are creative, they definitely put these on them. This one, I do not have a clue. Like, how you unlock it. Probably if you're, like, on the top of the architecture, I don't know. Or the, maybe the stylist, I could see it. I like how it fits the sim, though. This one looks like a, something a barber would wear. And it looks like it has, like, a scissor logo on it, I don't know. Or some scissors on it actually in that logo. So yeah, it's really, really cool. 
And okay, now we're moving on to probably some of the favorite items that we get to unlock with this with this sheet, which is the unlock outfits and the themed stuff that came with um ambitious. I'm just realizing just how many stuff came with ambitions and seriously, ambitions came with a shit ton of stuff that you have to unlock. This one, oh my gosh. Amazing guys. Freaking amazing. Looks like something an elf would wear when he's going to battle. And I am such a fantasy geek. I love Lord of the Rings. I love anime and all that stuff. So, you guys, literally, when I discovered this, I was like, are you kidding me? Why haven't I seen this sooner? Like, seriously? So, I'm pretty sure you guys get to unlock these when you guys use the time machine. This one looks like it's for the night. So if your sim is traveling back to the past, and when they get back, they're probably gonna um, be wearing this. And these also came with matching shoes as well, so that's freaking awesome. This one, I'm pretty sure if your sim is traveling way, way, way back in time to prehistoric times, um, <laughs> he's probably gonna be, he's probably gonna come back wearing this, like, I don't know caveman sort of outfit really really cool though i wish i unlocked it i did have a sim that maximized the inventing skill and i tried to send him down the time portal i mean the time machine but honestly when he came back he didn't bring or he didn't unlock anything for us so that pretty much sucked and this one is probably something from the future so yeah if you guys um are able to create time machine um you can go from the future or you go to the you can go to the past as well so this would actually look really work really really well if you guys have into the future like me and so yeah really really cool i love how it looks and that looks like it's going to be it for the ambitions and let's see here now we are in base game it looks like or whatever this one i do not know how you unlock this probably for your butler i'm not really sure but that this is pretty much it it looks really really cool though this is also available for formal wear so and most of the stuff that i showed you um are also available for multiple categories over here so you guys can discover that on your own but this one i would definitely put my sim on when he's like i don't know for his formal wear or probably even for his wedding i'm pretty sure and um these ones pretty sure came with a base game probably like for the doctor um profession medical profession this one is probably for i don't know it looks like a firefighting profession or i don't know police i really don't know probably firefighting or probably medical career you know for like emergency and stuff wow there's lots of stuff that came with medical this one looks like it's also for the medical career i don't know for emergency situations and all that stuff these ones are already unlocked like lab i mean i know not lab lab gowns like surgery gowns or whatever i'm not sure <laughs> so that's that this one you probably get when you maximize your culinary career to level 10 so yeah world class chef or whatever get your nice little medal and this could also work really well if you put like one of those nice little chef hats on your sims and this one looks like something a doctor would wear again, so yeah. And this one looks like, I'm pretty sure for the military career, um, yeah, military career. If your sim becomes an army general, or looks like something a pet he would wear when he's parachuting, actually. Look at all the details, sheesh, look at that, all the detail on the back, and all the cutouts, oh my gosh, freaking awesome. This one also looks like it came with a military career, if your sim's like a cadet or something. This one is for, I don't know, I'm guessing for the medical career, I'm pretty sure. And so let's see here, this one is for the NPC, for the mailman, really, really cute. And um, this one we saw earlier, we saw earlier. This one, I honestly do not know what it is, okay, now I know what it's for, it's for the pizza delivery guy. <laughs> Okay, so that's that. This one is I'm this one is for the grocery clerk, I'm pretty sure, because I had one of my Sims unlock these before. And this one is probably for the law enforcement or military, I don't know. Really, really awesome, really, really hot, you know. Men in uniform really really hot. That's what they all say though. And this one it's also probably for like the lesser 
um, you know, if you guys do, um have like are just starting in the culinary career, this is probably what you're gonna wear if you're like in the scullery or something. <laughs> okay, there's more stuff. <laughs> Ooh, this is tiring. This one looks like it's for the military career. It has a military logo and all that good stuff. I'm honestly not really sure. These ones look like... Okay, this one is probably for the astronaut. So I'm pretty sure the military has like two branches. And one of those is for... To make your sim an astronaut and all that really good stuff. So it's probably what he's going to wear. And this one definitely for the law enforcement. Yeah, that's what your sims wear. That's what actually policemen wear. The police NPCs. And this one is for the journalism career, I'm pretty sure. Or probably business, I'm not so sure. Journalism, I don't know. And this one is for the mechanic mechanic or the electric electrical technician, I don't know. Mechanical technician, I don't know. NPC that you guys call when you guys broke your sink or your toilet and all that good stuff. I'm not so sure this one. It looks like a ninja outfit. I honestly not sure how you unlock this. Probably when you have like a culinary career. I don't know. Or probably when you become like an international super spy or something. So yeah, from the political career or military, I'm not so sure. And this one also for the military career as well. And this one for the medical career. And a lot of these things we already saw earlier. They're just double glitch you know and this one probably for the international super spy as well so yeah <laughs> i'm not so sure though don't call me on that probably general in the military career if you see them wearing that we're skipping over these because we've already seen these this one for the medical career definitely there's lots of stuff that come for the medical career or maybe scientific oh, i forgot there's also a scientific science career so if I pretty much messed up medical and science career, I'm pretty sure 50-50 <laughs> for, for medical and science career. This one for your grocery. This one for an evil scientist, I'm pretty sure. It looks really, really good on an evil scientist. And for cop, we, got, we, see, we, we already saw these stuff. So, mailman outfit. And for ambitions, we have this servo outfit. Ooh, Really, really creepy on our stem. Kind of reminds me of the movie, um, what's it called? Bicentennial Man with what's his name? The guy from the guy who voices Genie from Aladdin when they were like tweaking his insides and all that stuff and he had his head. <laughs> creepy gives me the goosebumps. And this one, we already seen them. I'm just clicking on them just to make sure that you guys, um, don't have second guesses. Or don't doubt me. <laughs> this one is for the mummy, and it has like matching head as well. So a really really cool outfit. If you guys are in um, if you guys have World Adventures, and if you guys are in Awesome Hara, you guys could actually have a mummy curse, which will turn your sim into a mummy, or will probably kill your sim. I'm not so sure. And you guys can also encounter mummies when you're raiding the treasure of their tombs and all that good stuff. The first time I saw mummies, I literally screamed really, really hard. It freaked me out. Awesome outfit, though. This one looks like it's for the cleaner, you know, male maid, I don't know. Male maid? I don't know. House cleaner, butler? I really don't know. These ones we already saw, you know, earlier. And it looks like, yeah. Okay, let's see here. I'm pretty sure we've seen a almost pretty much all of these this one finally for the firefighter career um so yeah or the science career probably i'm sorry i forgot there was no firefighter for the base game but whatever don't quote me on that i'm really really not sure but anyway let me just put something on him really really quickly so that we can see um the shoes that we can unlock um so let's see there's also a ton of new shoes that we can put on our sims so yeah um first off are these ones that you guys can unlock when you have the robot fan so it's a whole set to make your sim look like he is wearing a cardboard box robot costume really, really cute this one looks like something that emmett would wear and would match the outfit that we saw earlier really really cool and this one came with island paradise probably when your sim is like jet skiing or whatever um 
parasailing, I guess. This, we're gonna wear this. And these ones also match the outfit that we saw earlier when your sims are like deep sea diving and all that good stuff. And these ones came with a mascot, but you guys don't have to unlock these though. I'm pretty sure we guys can access this from the get-go. These ones though, I'm pretty sure come for the llama mascot and these ones need to be unlocked, I'm pretty sure. And these ones came with the the gnome mascot, that's it. These ones came with the seasons expansion pack and these are roller skate, I guess. And you guys can't see because they're like submerged in the ground, but if you guys are skating, um, in the roller rink or whatever, um, in the festival lots, or you guys can purchase on your own as well. Um, you guys can see this in its full glory with the wheels. <laughs> and here we have um, some shoes for the alien. So if you guys add, add an alien to your household, you guys will be able to unlock this. We have some roller blades. So I guess if you level up your hidden skill high enough, or probably, oh, no, I'm kidding. Um, these are probably for the ice skating and these are for rollerblading. There we go. I got confused there <laughs> for a minute. Because in my country there is no ice skating because we live in a tropical country where there is no snow. So yeah, that's why I'm confused. So I hope you guys understand. These ones are matching with that armor thing that we saw earlier. This kind of looks really, really fantasy and something that elves, elf sims would wear. So that's really, really cool. And this one, the medieval um, kind of outfit that we have for the knights kind of outfit, probably going to wear something like this for their matching shoes. And I love how there's like a whole set of matching everything that came. The bad thing is that not many people know them. That's why I thought of making this overview and showcase of all the items. So hopefully you guys can also take advantage of what we have in game. So yeah. And these ones for the firefighting career, or probably for the science, I'm not really sure. These ones as well, I'm not sure what those are for. Probably for the astronaut. <laughs> There's ni some nice little boots here as well. He looks like he's a fisherman. <laughs> so yeah, these are like just doubling. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just going to put these on him. It's really, really cute. Looks like a fisherman. And let's see if there's any new accessories. Looks like there are. First off are the ones that came with Into the Future. These are the ones that I'm pretty sure Emmett was wearing. So really, really cool shades. I wonder how we can see from these. I love how shiny they are though. It's really, really cool. Wait, wait a second. Were, was Emmett wearing this? I'm not sure. Or probably, I don't know. But if you guys, um, I haven't played enough of Into the Future to unlock everything so yeah my let's play is still ongoing though so if you guys haven't seen that definitely check on that i'm at level 29 i mean i'm at <laughs> level 29 i'm at episode 29 right now so really 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 far into the let's play but it's still gonna take a while for it to finish though so yeah and let's see here let me just remove his glasses really quickly and let's see here we have some medals I guess if your sim like achieved something, you guys can unlock these for them. It kind of has a weird coloration though. I think it's because of this outfit though. Because when I tested it earlier, um, it kind of showed like legit this color, but probably glitch caused by this outfit. And then another medal that we sim sims can have. Probably when they achieve something like in ambitions that they maximize their um. Uh, I don't know, self-employment probably. This is probably like 50-50 and this is for 100%. I'm not so sure though, don't quote me on that. And let me just remove these. And let's see here. Um, oh, we also have the mermaid scales that we cannot see. But I'm pretty sure if you guys have Island Paradise, you already know what these looks like. So that's that. And we have this thing that came with... Um, university for the plant sim actually so that's that let me just put a plant sim outfit on him really quickly so you guys can see that um and it's full form so this is like a body paint for plant sims it looks like so yeah like i've said earlier these outfits that i've showed you guys and you know, accessories and shoes 
um, a lot of them um, can be used for formal wear and for other types of, you know, clothing options. So that's it. Kind of distracting with the scales. But that is pretty much it for the adult men. Um, I'm going to, um, of course, there's going to be, um, I know I said I'm going to show each and every life state, but... Um, it's pretty much the same for the elders and for the teens and for the toddlers as well. It's pretty much the same, just a different version for them. So, yeah. Because if I show you guys everything, that's going to take me forever. So, what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to move on to show you guys um, the, ac the assets, clothing and hairstyles that came for the females. Okay, guys. So, I think I'm going to cut and I'm going to be right back when I get everything... Um, all settled and all that good stuff okay guys i'll see you in a little bit